Welcome everyone, it's Dave versus Drake Amar. It's time for some more. Raid Shadow Legends. We are going to be continuing on our journey of doom. Um, and I've got to uh, start leveling food. <laughs> <laughs> food. So much food leveling. They're like, I have no do Ash Ridge Saddle is like, I have no dupe rares. There is no dupe rares. Like me with like an absolute ocean, a champion ocean of rares. I'm like, yeah, dude, that's because you're a whale. <laughs> that's why you have so many legendaries. <sighs> and no rares. And that's why you have so few epics, too. The reason, the reason is because you're a whale, Ash. You're a whale. Uh. <laughs> oh, man. It's like, what kind of, what kind of person has... This many duplicate legendaries. I'm like, Ash. I'm looking at you. I am looking at you. You'd be like, no, what what do you mean? Oh, I'm not. It's I'm not that. I'm not that. I'm like, you are. Cause I can't even use. See, see, I, I can't even. I can't even use. I cannot even use any of this it doesn't exist for me it literally doesn't exist because of the legendaries i have up here including vizier drockle the gaunt who everyone hates and Manaya, they're only singular legendaries. I have no dupes of any kind of legendary. Um, why not? Then I have to do more Minotaur. Mm, War of Steel. Yeah, I have to go grind more scrolls for Kale because I want the number one mastery I want on him. I don't care about the rest of them. The number one mastery I want is um, do I want Wrath of the Slain? Or cycle of violence. Um, why not? I don't know which one I should take of those. So I'm going to leave it alone. We are going to be doing this, though. I have to farm the other thing. Trying 
for four for each enemy alive. Sounds about right. I got both the 30k, although we can do better. We can definitely do better. Um, but I I am gonna still stick to trying to do that mission. Where are we at? Okay, yeah, we'll just save this for when I run out of energy fuel inevitably trying to get trying to get the dumb thing trying to get the trying to win this mission man See, these missions are annoying and they're getting to be more annoying it's very and i want to emphasize this it's very hard to get arbiter and you know what's even harder thinking about people who have that many legendary champions like dude like i don't even my mind just doesn't even comprehend having that many legendaries it keeps telling me vaporsmith you can't H how how why does anyone have that many legendaries because i swear to god Nobody I know in my whole clan has this thing with dupe legendaries. It's a problem just getting a legendary. Never mind a dupe legendary. Boy, so hard to do. Never mind maxing them all. Maxing them is a nightmare, by the way. Is that I have to, like, raise up a bunch of food just to make it happen. Now, with this boss, I prefer to first kill the, the night thingies. Because then that means that afterwards, the night thingies can't haunt me. I don't want to, like, start the uh, heart seeker thing and everything until she removes this buff. See, once she does that... Wham. Wham. Try to increase its duration. Um, try to increase its duration again. That fails. Poison her. Um, go for it again. There we go. Because that's what we want. We want the duration of the buff to increase. Because once we get this this uh, thing on her, we don't want her to start willy-nilly running around and healing. We want that under control. Yeah, we want that under control. I don't have any dupe Legos, so anything to do with dupe Legos, forget about it. <laughs> Forget about it, because nobody... I mean, I have a number of legendaries, but I don't get dupes of these. And I still have to do potion keep shenanigans because of Arbiter, you know? To get N Arbiter. Notice how I said N Arbiter, not Arbiter dupes. N Arbiter. It feels like an absolute outrage that someone has more than one Arbiter. It really is. It feels like an extravagant outrage. Because, like, do you know how few people even own Arbiter? And then, like, there's this guy's like, I've got two of them. It's like, what the hell? Like, what is up with that? Why? Huh. You know, I just, I don't understand it. Like, duplicate legendaries. Like, it's a sign. It's a sign from God that you've spent too much on this game. If you have duplicate legendaries. I guarantee it. 
I guarantee you have spent too much on this game if you have duplicate legendaries. Especially as much as Ash has. Oh my god. Like I'm like watching this like... Are you serious? It, it's bad enough to try to get one legendary. That's bad enough. That would probably empty all my shards. And I don't even have many shards right now, but... Like, my shards in the future, just to get one legendary of any kind. But to have duplicates, and to have enough to want to actually disintegrate them. Oh! That's hard! Like... It gives me a headache thinking about it. The idea of having dupe legendaries multiple enough that you would actually if you would actually sacrifice your legendary to like in order for that to even to even appeal to me at all i'd need a lot more legendaries i'd need at least one legendary dupe but i don't even have that in order for that to appeal to me to even mildly appeal I mean, I, I, I can't even do Faction Guardians with Legendaries. Never mind Sacrifice, which is what I would do, obviously. I do Faction Guardians. But I can't even do that with Legendaries because I don't have them. I don't have the dupes. Don't, it doesn't exist. And they're like, but Scylla the Drakes is a dupe. No, I only have one of her. I only have one of her. So where does that put me? All right. Fair enough. What has been happening with the rest of these accounts, man? Like, like what? Like my mo my mind thinks of 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 people having duplicate legendaries as an outrage. Like, I'm not saying having legendaries. Having legendaries is not an outrage. It's just part of the game. But having duplicate legendaries is an outrage. Especially that many. That many legendaries, that many duplicates is, is an outrage. I'm sorry. I, I... Just thinking about people sacrificing duplicate legendaries when other, so many of us don't even have legendaries... Or, like, barely have a legendary, like, if we have, like, one or two, if that. It's it's hard. It's really hard for me, you know? I, I, I can't explain it to you guys. Like, duplicate rares and epics, I get it. I get it. But duplicate legendaries? <sighs> Having, th like, just, ugh. Makes me ill, like in the mind or something. Like I, it, it feels bad. You're like, I made a four, a four, ascended champion. Was that a mistake? I'm like, yes. The fact you were willing to sacrifice four legendaries for one, in and of itself, is a mistake. Uh, it's a mistake because legendaries are special, man. It's a monstrous thing to do to slay a legendary. But to slay it four times for one. To slay it four times. Isn't it? Bad enough to kill one legendary, but to kill it four times. This is all theoretical, all academic, right? It's like that thing about Horcruxes. I swear to God, it's like that because it's like, oh, and he he split his soul. And he, with the legendaries, and not just once, 
You meaning to say he did it four times? <laughs> uh, that's literally what it feels like. That's what it feels like. I'm sorry, but that's what it feels like. I am being real with you. That's what it feels like. Like, I, I'm, I'm being honest. I'm being honest with you because it's wickedly hard to get legendaries. Wickedly hard. Like... like I don't, I don't get it. Like, wouldn't four be the best number of legendaries? Wouldn't four? Merlin's beard! I isn't it? Is it bad enough considering killing one legendary champion? But to kill four legendaries? <laughs> oh, God. I, I'm still... I'm still reeling thinking about it. Like. Champion empowerment has to be one of the worst things. That's ever come up with the idea of doing that to a legendary champion. Oh. It's hard to imagine. It's hard to imagine having enough legendaries that you would literally sacrifice four, four dupes, four dupes to make one. Six starring champions is bad enough. <laughs> That's five rank fives that you had to raise from little babies of champions you don't want. And they all have to die. But to sacrifice, to literally, literally sacrifice four, four legendaries. Like, I, I can't even, I can't even believe that Ash would actually do that. Wow. I thought he was a nice guy. Why would he do that? I, like, <sighs> Killing a legendary is such a monstrous thing to do. But to do it four times. <laughs> uh, anyway, we're going to fight this spirit keep boss. And hope to God that I could get these potions done with. Let's just do the higher difficulties because I want to get this over with. Uh, Hmm. 
Yeah, I, I just I can't I can't see it happening. I, I can barely see me having even a fraction of what that guy has in champions. A fraction. And my champion collection is cluttered. Granted, it's not cluttered with the same rarity of champions he has. It's they're all epics and like I have like four dupe kales. But even with the four dupe kales, I still wouldn't consider like like I would barely consider unbinding them. Never mind legendaries. Legendaries? These, these ladies are so annoying. These Crimson Helms. Whenever I'm fighting this boss. <sighs> like I'm literally doing this for an Arbiter mission. Believe it or not. Literally doing this for an Arbiter mission. Then I'm trying to decontaminate my 40s. And then, of course, as you go up the food chain, the boss gets harder. Mm. You know another thing that I remember Ash doing? Feeding cold hearts randomly as if it was nothing. I was like, dude, that is such a monstrous thing to do. Like, and then I'm like, okay, that's the last of the monstrous things he's going to do. Decides to sacrifice four Nethrals of a champion I've never pulled in my life. It's like, wait, what? You did what? Is it was more of a shock than even like get, Delta getting Urigrim or the Jazar is someone killing four legendaries. It's like, no, no, I don't need those four. I just want to empower the one. What? <sighs> I swear, the top of this game is just ridiculous. It makes no sense to me. But yeah, we're going to want to decrease his turn meter. Because I do not... I do not need... I do not need this boss taking more turns. Really? Really? You just had to do me like that? I can't... Do I have to go to the next... Like, we'll do it like three times. I have to keep trying to get this keep... To give me the potion. And then from there, what do I got to do?
I'll go for that. Come on, please. Actually, thank you. Why do they have to put these crimson helms? I swear the crimson helm is even almost more annoying than the boss itself. Ugh. Like, why is crimson helms in this dungeon? I don't understand it. Just like, what is the thing about the empowering legendaries? Why has this been included? Why? Just, just why? So that people can do monstrous things like kill legendaries. Because uh, that's probably the, one of the most monstrous things you can do in this game is to kill a legendary. And it's like, you know what? We're going to enable that. You're going to what? Yes, we're going to enable that you kill your legendaries. Excuse me? Yes, we're going to enable it. I'm like... What has this world come to? That this is okay? That enabling people to kill legendaries is okay? Because <laughs> it's not okay! <laughs> All right? It's not okay. It's not okay. Uh, keep smacking the boss. I don't... I swear, this patch is making me lose it. Uh, come on. Please. You know what the worst part is about this whole thing? There are some people who will never get a legendary in this game. Until 180 days in or something. Or from Fragment Fusions. There will literally be people that won't even see a legendary until the late game. And some won't even see it at all because they won't persist long enough. That's the real sad thing. That's the real sad part. There's going to be a lot of people that won't even get to see the champion that the, the thing is about. They won't even get to see one. Never mind a dupe. Come on, game. For the love of Pete, give me the thing. At least, at least we're increasing our champion potion keeps thing. <sighs> okay, when we run out of energy fuel, we'll just load up on that. I'm going to put Tayrell in there. Wait, do we have anything new? We do. Do and some food to boot. Except for Armager, it's straight food. Although Armager for this account's food because I have a lot of Armagers. And I can get Armager anytime I want. It's not like a legendary. Like How do I even explain the pain, the mental angst of thinking about, like, I, I don't know. I, I, is anyone else like deeply disturbed by the idea of killing legendaries or is it just me? Is anyone else deeply disturbed by this concept? I hope someone is because this looks like this feels ridiculous. Like, the concept of doing that feels ridiculous. 
it's hard to even imagine having enough legendaries that sacrificing one would would not completely destroy your account never mind sacrificing four four of them Uh that idea just it hurts. What would it even be like to be someone so rich? And have so many legendaries, they can actually afford to empower one. What would that be like? What would that even be like? That's hard to even imagine. I'm I'm being serious. Like I don't even I don't even know what that would be like. God, that would feel weird. To be so powerful that you don't care. It doesn't destroy your account to kill four. God, that feels weird. God. Just trying to imagine that hurts. It really does. I know it doesn't hurt any of you. But like... I, I'm having trouble imagining that right now. I'm having trouble imagining. Like, basically, I'd have to have, like, suddenly legendaries turn into, like, rares for me. It'd be like that. It would literally, legendaries would have to go down to the commonality of almost of farmable rares. Almost, for me to want to do that. That is literally, or, or like, epics like crappy epics like that's literally what it would have to come down to i kid you not that is literally what would have to happen before i would even consider it i would have to have it even enough legendaries that i'm basically swimming in legendaries like, I'd have to have, like, I'd have to have so many legendaries that it wouldn't harm me to murder them. Which is an unbelievable extravagance. Hmm. <sighs> so hard to imagine my mind is just like what the hell is this world come to where people have that much of an extravagance that they can just like ah you know what let's kill four copies of this guy and it won't hurt me a little bit and everyone else will struggle for like several ages Trying to um, get even a single copy of that same champion. <laughs> uh, like, let me put it this way. It's going to be a struggle for me to even get a single copy of any of those champions. Like... It'll be lucky that in a year's time, I will get a Nethro. One Nethro. We're not talking duplicate Nethros. One. 
and he killed four. Four of them. Four. This boss is really annoying, if you couldn't tell, and boring, because you just have to keep applying the heal reduction and block buffs on her repeatedly until she dies, basically. And, in addition, just if you thought this wasn't ridiculous enough, I have to try to beat this Arbiter mission to get one copy. Uh, I really want an Arbiter one day. I know it's an absolute struggle to get an Arbiter, and I understand that. But I really want one. What on earth are these team powers? What kind of hell am I in? What kind of hell is that? Okay, let's give it a go. Okay, this isn't even close. Wow, what the actual hell? I can't, I can't do anything. This, this is, this is BS. That was straight up BS. Can we get anything even mildly reasonable? Okay. I don't care. We're doing it. Uh, yeah, let's give it a shot. I don't care. Let's give it a shot with a number of team comps. If this one fails, we'll get another one. Well, this one definitely failed. Okay. Let's try a new team. Let's... Let's put High Cartoon in there because we need a speed lead. So right now we are slow as molasses. Um, yeah, we are slow as molasses. As I realized, okay, we're still slow as molasses. Okay then. Um, we're screwed. Okay, I am gonna stop doing that. And just fight you. There we go. That'll that'll give me something. You know. Yeah. Let's give it a go. I'm assuming their damage is the... is the shield guard, but I could be wrong. I'm trying to calculate what that is. Uh, 
Um, I don't see us winning this, actually, from this standpoint. Yeah, I don't see it. I'm going to try something with more damage. I don't care. I don't care. Um... See, the thing is, I don't have a Madame Ceres, so that's not going to work. Um... Let's try this combination. Definitely going to want to focus him down. It's not going to be easy to kill a Stag Knight, I can tell you that right now. isn't going to work. I can't find any teams that are actually fightable in here except for this one. Um Yeah, why not? Why not just kill it? The fact that we're not instantly killing it's hilarious. Okay, I can't find anyone else besides that. The rest of them are busted. This looks like absolute torture. Even though it's only 106 player power, it still looks like torture. Oh, we just have to fight a clan boss. Although I want to do that mission... I want to do that mission. Alright, we're going to go fight this boss again. You know the drill. Kill the soldiers. Kill the soldiers and then kill the main lady by starving her of turn meter. And healing reducing her and blocking her buffs. And poisoning her and burning her. 
we're obviously just want to pick off these uh, these helpers because the helpers make the job a lot more difficult. There we go. Put that up there. Try to increase the duration. Try to do it again. Poisoner. Try to increase it again. That duration in, go. Do that. Yeah, get that duration up. At least her ink decrease accuracy is also there. And there we have it. No, we don't have it. I want, I want those potions, man. What do I have to do? Why is this so hard for it to just give me a superior potion? The drop rates on these are just pathetic. I am considering on helping Manaya though. I do think Manaya has a lot of good uses. Even though you guys might not think it, there's a possibility. Um. The one on the right. The one on the right always seems to do dumb stuff. Not always, but like... The only time I actually want to stop the one on the left is when the one on the left does something like decrease defense. When it does that and the boss hits as hard as it does, it's like, no, 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 no. We are... We are focusing the other one. There's, there's no way we're going to leave... Please, I swear to God, just there we go. Decrease our turn meter. I like how she can heal the whole thing in one go. Oh, unless I actually put the buff on her. She has to have the the heal reduction buff at this point. There is no getting away from it. You have to have it. You have to have someone that applies it or you or some way to either eternally turn meter and nuke her or applies heal reduction in order to stop this boss. You are literally not stopping this boss without some form of heal reduction from something most of the time, unless you can literally lock her down and nuke her the entire time. You have to do one or the other or both. Cold heart does both. So I'm lucky enough to have a cold heart. Not everyone does. My other account doesn't. Huh. 
and one day, one day I'll get a cold heart in the other account. You're like, you're, you're wishing for a rare? It's a void rare, and it's a valuable void rare. It's one of the best champions you can get without wailing like absolute nuts. Although I would not put it past some people to actually wail for a cold heart, because it took me an incredibly long time to get a cold heart. An incredibly long time. Like 200 days. And then the game eventually is like, I'll take pity on you. I'll give you a cold heart. Here. Psst. Don't tell anyone. Okay. Really, game? Really? I swear to God. Just give me the potion. They need to make the drop rates of these. At least tell me what the drop rates on these are. Because the drop rates are so excruciatingly low. It's the same with legendaries. That's why I was so indignant about it. Because legendaries have such a low drop rate. They have such a low drop rate. It's not like you can just get them anywhere. They have such a low drop rate. You'll think you have a legendary? No, nope, you have another epic. You think you have a legendary? No, nope, it's a rare. You think you have a legendary? No, nope, it's another, it's an uncommon. Or an epic, or, or a rare. Like, it's not, it's so rare that when you finally see that gold, you're like... I've like hit one of Raid's best champions now that I finally struck gold. Like, it's... I can't tell you the feeling of what it really feels like when rares are... I mean, legendaries are truly scarce. Like, there's this one legendary that you got. It could happen to my second account, too. Like, oh, I might get Sathia Flame Tongue. I got Sathia Flame Tongue! And the other guy's like, nah, I don't, I don't care. I have like five dupes of Cynthia Flame Tongue. Like, excuse me. That's basically what it feels like. And like, I'm gonna kill four of those dupes. Excuse me. You're doing what now? Because I, I never really realized it's not just, it's not just, um oh, you know, it's going to separate the free-to-play and the pay-to-win. It's allowing the, the pay-to-win people to commit crimes against humanity. That's what it's allowing. Basically what it's allowing. It's allowing them to commit crimes against humanity. I'm against all of legendaries. I get it. Oh, I get the pun. It's allowing them to commit legendary crimes. Uh That's what it is. Now now I can now I can make it simple. I can make it sound very simple. <sighs> Plarium is enabling legendary crimes. That's what it is. That's literally what this is. Legendary crimes. Yeah. That's what it is. 
I, I get it now. I get it. That's what it is. It's like, you know, I'll kill all four Voldemorts and we'll all shove them into one. <laughs> we'll, we'll empower Voldemort to four. <laughs> we'll empower him. <laughs> I have enough copies of Voldemort. <laughs> oh, it's a farce, man. It's a really, it is a farce. Uh, come on, game. Please. Please give me the thing. I want it. Please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And of course, there's another Arbiter mission. Uh, but there we go. 32,000. I'm even beating them on that. Let's go. Let's go. I need to do some Ice Golem or some of these other ones. I can do more Minotaur, but I'm not going to. Because I've got a mission I want to do in the next episode, obviously. <laughs>